What is up, 40 family? And welcome back to the channel, guys. We're back with another Australia video. This time it's 10 things Australians do better than Americans. I did five. Here's 10 more. It's a little shorter than the last one, but we finna see 10 more things on why Australians do better than Americans. So, hey, if y'all want to see more, y'all send out more recommendations. Hey, hit that subscribe button. Let's jump into it. Let's jump into it. Let's see. Let's see what it is. Job and full of beans, no doubt. I thought they talked like us. Does anyone else speak Australian? <laughs> Australia and the U.S. have a lot in common. We don't have uh, a better friend in the world, uh, as well as the Asia Pacific region, than Australia. The two countries okay. share a language. They have a speak Australian. A regional fondness for surfing, and even oh. have the same mother country. There are some things, though, that Australians just do better. Let's say, Number 10, let's say. live longer. Aussies outlive <laughs> Americans by nearly 41 months. They also have- They came out on the top and said, live longer, dang. Live longer. Aussies outlive Americans by nearly 41 months. They also have fewer deaths that result from serious health problems like heart disease dang. and cancer. Number nine, whiskey. Hey, if you need an extra 40 months to live, go to Australia. Hobart Sullivan's Cove French Oak Cask Single Malt, a spirit distilled in Tasmania, was not long ago named the finest of its kind on the planet Grand at the World Tasmania. Whiskies Awards. Other contenders included entrants from the US, Japan, and Scotland. Mm. Number eight, gender equality. In 2012, okay. Australia was given the top spot on a list that ranked countries according to how well they supported the professional advancement of women. Factors included access to education, childcare, equal pay, and policies that deter discrimination. Oh, Number seven, ocean pools. Hanging what? out at the beach can be great, but the water itself could harbor any number Dang, of dangerous species. Nice. Australians true, have solved true. the problem by putting saltwater pools in several locales where the sand meets Dang. the sea. Number six, controlling the cost of college. An American education costs, on average, nearly $14,000 mm -hmm. a year. Attending an institution of higher learning in Australia has a median annual price tag of about $7,500. Number five. Dang, that's how much I paid for one semester, just a semester, probably more than that. That's expensive. Has a median annual price tag of about $7,500. Number five, the gap year. In Australia, it's perfectly normal for recent high school graduates to wait a year before attending college. Those who do mm. are encouraged to spend time traveling, working, or both. Number four, be nice. pizza. It may come as a complete shock, but That's an Australian chef was named as having the best pizza at the 2014 mm. World Pizza Championship. I had some uh, boys next to me that were from New York, um, a really famous pizzeria in New York, and, and the, one of the owners from that uh, pizzeria was uh, you know, hitting my shoulder saying, you won, you won. The competition is Dang. held every year in Parma, Italy, and draws competitors from around the globe. Number three, median wealth. According to a Credit Suisse report, adult Australians have a median wealth of over $190,000, while in the U.S. it's Dang. closer to $40,000. These figures yeah, include retirement savings be... and home values. Dang. Number two, building livable cities. The Economic Intelligence Unit's annual livability survey not only found Melbourne, Australia to be the best place to live, four other Australian metropolises landed in the top ten. No American Dang. cities made the cut. Number one, Happiness. Crazy. Australians have Happiness. actually been deemed the happiest people in the world three years in a row now, among industrialized nations anyway. The US did pretty well too, Dang. coming in at sixth. What do you think Australians do best? Hey, it seems like everybody overseas is doing a little better than America. And sometimes, sometimes, like when it comes to college, uh, being happy, because that's what I'm talking about when I'm watching my Netherlands, my videos about Holland and all that stuff, the Netherlands, like, them over there, their their kids are super happy. Our kids are super stressed over here because school. We learn this stuff they don't need most of the time. But hey, I can agree with that list too. The five and now the ten. That fifteen things I agree with Australia. That fifteen things. But that's all I have for this video, guys. Y'all make sure y'all hit that subscribe button. Send out more recommendations, man. I'm into man. Now I gotta go visit Australia. Just staying away from them snakes, though. But, hey, I got two two things on my bucket list now. Two countries to visit on my bucket list now. But, hey, y'all be blessed. Be the best. Then be you. I'm out.